Can we see? Okay, you can't see Pornji. It's on the table already. Pornji's right here. <laughs> okay, welcome everybody for a, another live Cats and Pets. Um, you got me? Oh, that's right. I had to kind of aim the camera down so you can see the table because it's going to be kind of important. Slash, you can see this little girl. And I got my, uh, my film producer. Your okay. lovely assistant? Yeah. Okay, my wife right. Sarah here. I'm going to try to pull up the comments. Hi, Humira. Hi, quick. Cookie Girl. And hopefully this isn't too loud. I can turn it down fast enough. Okay. Oh, there we go. <clears throat> thank you, thank you. Um, we're gonna probably have the chat here, that way I don't have to be like all up like this to be able to see everything. So, <clears throat> today is a birthday celebration. Happy birthday to me. This guy, right here. Also, <laughs> um, it's kind of around our cat's birthdays, I think. Uh, well, Moxie two, and two Luna, of them. Luna two of them. are born around this time of year, so we can celebrate their birthday with yours. Yeah, so two of our kitties are kind of in a, end of summer kitties. One of them's birthday might be more of May. Not exactly sure. But that's Was our that? best estimate. Yeah, so we're gonna do this. Hi, Cookie Girl. Hi, Kelsey. Hi, Ham Fam Fan. We were discussing favorite Hamilton songs. Ooh. Do you have a favorite Hamilton song? Ah, it changes, you know, because the more you listen to it, mm -hmm. the more, like, you just find things, even th songs that maybe weren't your favorite, become favorite. I always like, um, I can't name the name, but what's the one with Wait for it. George Washington and Alexander Hamilton and when they first meet and... Oh, the, here comes the general? Yeah, that one. Yeah. I, I don't think that's Good the name one. Of it, but I like uh, it. yeah. But I, like I, I know what you're talking about. Okay, so the plan today, and this is not something I've done before. <laughs> I was gonna Hamilton. This is not something I've done before, but I want to make a cake for cats, for our cats. So it's not a cat cake, um, not a human cake for our consumption. Uh, I do have a friend on YouTube that makes cakes. Her name's uh, Jana. Her channel's Pinch of Luck. I don't know. I can't link that. Pinch of Luck. You can look for it if you, you want. You can to. link it after the fact. Though. Oh, I can link it after the fact. Maybe I'll do that. <laughs> but anyway, back to it. Kitty cat. Cake. Cake for kitty cats. And so I've got some wet food, I've got some ideas in my head, and we'll see how it turns out. They all... Basically what he's saying is, we're not sure how this is gonna go. <laughs> I think it's gonna go grand, personally. So, first things first, I guess I should've gotten it beforehand, a cutting board might be good. Okay, I'll get that. So, cutting board, and maybe a plate. Okay. Um, maybe... Oh, we'll worry about that later. Cake nutrition versus people nutrition. <laughs> um, okay. So, my plan here was trying to make it kind of decorative. I have some varieties of cat foods, which I'm hoping are different colors, because I'm not going to put, like, food dye and stuff in here. Um, so I got some ones oh, that shreds, let's see, ocean whitefish and tuna dinner. Might be a little whiter looking, I'm hoping. Um, I got another one I thought was salmon. That's hoping to be kind of a little pink. Uh, white fish, chicken with gravy. I don't know, we're gonna try to improv the colors, but... Yeah, we'll see. So, first idea is the one that I think will look the best. It's like a ziggurat style pyramid type thing. Or a ziggur cat style. See what I did there? It's, it's gold, right? So... <laughs> I want to have possibly two. Uh, the kids are. The kids are getting excited because I think they realize they were playing with. Do you guys know what's happening? Um. So I think I mean we could just stick with circles, but I think squares looks a little bit cooler, a little bit more step stony, and uh. It's your vision. I'm just yeah. here to help, help make it a reality. You can't hold back an odd. <laughs> okay, so. All right, I'm gonna go through comments okay. real quick before we get started. Okay. Um. So, oh, Kelsey says you're a good dad and mom to the kids. Thank, <laughs> Thank you. you. Thank you. Um, Cookie Girl agrees. Kelsey says keep it up. Cat Lover 36 plus cute kitten says hi. Hello, Cat Lover. Hello. Um, and okay, Cookie Girl okay. says this sounds interesting. Nita says no party hats or guests. Uh, I meant Where's to. Where's the cat kegger? Yeah, that's right. We have some balloons somewhere in this house. I thought about that. I actually thought about getting like a birthday boy hat, but then I <laughs> kind of didn't get around to didn't it. Didn't fully commit. Okay, All right, so, so what are we doing? Right now I'm trying to organize my things. By the flavors. I just got a variety pack of uh, various foods. They weren't the most expensive ones, which is kind of nice. Uh, so we got ocean whitefish, we got turkey giblet, giblets? 
Giblets. 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 Mariner's catch, which sounds pretty awesome. So fancy. Uh, two Mariner's catches. Stick that there. Move the quarter to the side. Poultry platter. That one sounds a little bit more orange colored. White. Wait, white fish and sardines. Oh, that's the shreds. All right. Yeah, you got to keep your shreds and your pâtés organized. So, yeah, pâtés is what we're going to be building with here. Um, shreds, I think, are going to be a little bit more of a decoration garnish type thing, maybe. Just kind of my plan. Um, I think I meant to. Sorry, sorry, I'm okay. Sarah's breaking things. <laughs> Um, <laughs> the word giblet is just uncomfortable to say, not sure why. Yeah, no, giblet, or, I don't know, moist is kind of a weird word. Uh, I don't know, my onomatopoeia are... is kind of fun to say. Pillows, my so, I kind of meant to, oh yeah, that's good. I meant to stick these in the fridge so they'll be a little bit more sturdy. Poor planning, <laughs> means I just stick this in the fridge. So. I think it'll still work, even I if think so too. Chilled. So I think a good base might be... The ocean whitefish and tuna dinner. I'm hoping this is kind of white looking. And also, if you try to do this, make sure you get a maybe some Tupperware or something, because I don't think your cat's gonna eat four cans of cat food or anything. So let's see. What are people saying? Wow. Um, I don't know if you saw this, but Cookie Girl 101 says your channel is the best cat channel ever. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Um. And I think you got the giblet one. Cookie Girl 101 says DIY cat cake. Yes, that's what we're yeah. trying, DIY trying cat to make cake. happen. Um, hmm. And then Cookie Girl says, do you guys have an Instagram? Well, yes. funny you should ask. <laughs> yes. Sarah's been on me about being on it. Um, Jason has an Instagram for cats and pats. It's, which is cats and pats. Yeah. Straight up cats and pats. And Sarah has an Instagram for her Sarah yeah, stuff. Yeah, for my nutrition stuff. Which, That's Sarah Moran Nutrition. I say, a good husband will tell you what that is. <laughs> but yeah, Jason's is cats and pats, so if you want to see more cute kitty pictures. That's... And Sarah's going to get all me about posting on there. I haven't been, unfortunately. Man, that's um, kind of the same brown as part of that. Whoa! Someone came sliding in here. What's going okay. on, y'all? Luna's like chasing each other. Okay. So. Wait one second. More oh, comments. Ahead. Kelsey says, oh, in the last live stream you said... Hope you have fun with my new kitty. I've been having a lot of fun. That's awesome, Kelsey. Oh! New I forgot about are that. The best. I keep on hearing people keep on saying that like they've just got a kitten or like they have a ten week old kitten or maybe they've got like an old cat. That's the most exciting thing to me, because like you know, kitty cats. You can yeah. never have enough. They're adorable. They're lovable. So That's awesome. And Cookie Girl says that she's gonna go check out the Instagrams right now. Sue Ward says, I went through trying to get my cats to eat different cat food. They walked away from everything except Performatrin from Pet Value. They can be picky. Big yeah, kitties. especially... <laughs> where did that one go? Bugger! You want me to go get So, her? our little black kitty, Luna, will just not eat very... Ow! I stubbed my toe. I'm having trouble today. Sarah's struggling. <laughs> my little black kitty, Luna, like... You don't even put down, like, tuna fish or salmon, like... You know, what we'd be eating for dinner or something. She's like, hmm, not so much. Which is... Kind of inconvenient because what I like to use a lot of times when we have to give our kitties medicine is like wet food to put like a pill in or something. She just walks away from it. So the one thing she does like is like, it's I don't okay. know, Temptations it's okay. generic. It's okay. She does she, not want she, to be on film right now. Okay. She is, <laughs> well she just ran in here chasing somebody. Yeah, her tail is flipped out. So, all right, you want to read stuff? What I'm going to try to do at first okay. is uh, take one of these things and I'm going to try to cut it in a nice square. I thought it was a little bit bigger than this, but it's not. So, let's see. Ooh. Wow. Ooh, a special. Oh, that's a good idea. Okay. Okay. Um, Nita says, Jason, if you pay Sarah, I'm sure she'll post your pictures, but she's <laughs> expensive. <I love> it. <laughs> Cookie Girl says, the struggle is real when you stub your toe, and Pinch of Luck Sweet says, hi. Hello. That's, that's the, the cake person we need. Yeah, that's right. She could probably yeah. make this. Well, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Have you ever made any cat cakes before? Have you ever made a cake out of cat food? <laughs> I'm guessing not. But, you know, maybe me and Janet need to have a cake off sometime. Yeah, a cat cake. It could be a human cake, but cat themed. <laughs> so that's what I got. Yeah, she said she's never tried a cat cake, so oh, uh, be a, a little, new challenge. A little broken up. All right, so... So what what is the plan? So my plan was to get my oh I can't really see it my base here, and to cut off like a nice square, and then smaller squares to kind of stack it up. 
Do you think I should stick with circles? I don't know. The thing with a circle is, do we have like a circle cookie cutter? Hmm, I'm burping, excuse me. A circle cookie cutter? I just freehand that. Or, okay. Going rustic. Yeah, going rustic. Um, okay, okay. You think square? You yeah, think squares see? is better or circles are better? Uh, you need a cookie cutter. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And CM Coleman Home says, love the cake, the cat cake idea. <laughs> cookie Girl says, you know you're a cat person when you make your cats a cake and little toys. <laughs> fam, fam, fan says, my family got a litter of six kittens to foster. Uh, yeah, um, it's overwhelming, but it just means there's more to love and floof. Also <laughs> means more poop, but I suppose the love outweighs uh, the poop. Yeah. <laughs> um, CM Coleman says, squares are better. Ooh, right. Pinch of Luck says you could use drinking glasses to cut it into circles if you want to do circles. That would be awesome if we had any skinny base glasses, but all our glasses are about <laughs> about that big, so <laughs> that only worked on the very first one, I think. Yeah. So I'm going to um, try... Uh, let's try that at first. Let's see. I feel like they need to raise you up on a platform because uh, you're not really in frame right yeah, now. Yeah, a shoebox or something to put it on? Um, There's uh, the shoeboxes that we're trying to make the, the clips glasses of. Oh, yeah. Okay. They're right downstairs. I'll go, I'll go find that. Okay, so email. I'm going to... <laughs> all the kitty cats are in here. They're excited. They smell everything. All right, so that's, that's level one right now. I made it mostly square. The biggest thing I wanted to do... Try not to drop this. The biggest thing I wanted to do is have... A, have as big a base as possible. Um, I think that kind of worked. So I'm just gonna here slide on my my plating plate here. All right, let's. All right, uh, go ahead and maybe put the cutting board on top of that. Okay. There we go. Now y'all can see a little bit better. What's uh, okay. Happening. Okay. Look at that. All right, people are saying things, but I'm missing it. Okay, I'll read. Um, Nita says. You know how some people make dog dog treats out of human food? Can the same be done, but cat friendly? I'm sure there are. People have asked a lot before about raw food diets and stuff. I haven't looked into that stuff at all. Really? I'm sure you could make homemade cat treats. I feel like you see you the dog it. stuff more often, but I feel like there's got to be some recipes out there. But it's not something right. we've ever tried. Um, Let's try Mary's cat. CM Coleman <laughs> says circles say more wedding cake. Unless you're wearing them <laughs> off. So, Maybe. Oh, um, wait, that See, that one's a little Sue, more pinky. Looking. Sue Ward says, can you please say hi to John Ward? Hi, John. Hi, John Ward. <laughs> I hope things are going well for you, John. Cookie Girl says, did you guys see the eclipse? Oh, yeah. So, we made made shoebox things, which, eh. Um, people said, like, don't have eclipse glasses? Make your own DIY. I'm like... Okay, I mean, it's kind of cool that you can see it, but like... Not the th same. That's kind of the same to me as watching on TV, so it's not really that impressive. But our local library did have an event where you could come there and get glasses and stuff, so... Sarah went over there and got some glasses, and I left work and met her over there. Whew! This and smells real good right in here right now. Yum, yum, yum! <laughs> And I, I went over there, and yeah, we watched the whole thing. It was a lot of fun. I don't know, the eclipse is just pretty awesome. Yeah, it's amazing. So we're in Virginia, so we're a little bit north of where you can see the totality. But we got like 82.5% here. Yeah. So it was pretty awesome. Yeah. It was still definitely very light outside, but it was kind of like a darker, cloudy day without any clouds. If that makes sense. Yeah. I think it makes sense. Yeah. Um... Kelsey says, my cat plays monkey in the middle, and you guys are very awesome and great. <laughs> Thanks, Kelsey. Thank you. Um, Holly Goodwin says, hey. Hey. Nita likes your square. Um, mm. Chloe the Flower says, hi. Hello. Sue Ward says, thanks. Pinch of Luck says, that is not how my kitchen smells. LOL. <laughs> yeah, it probably doesn't smell nearly as good as icing. And what's it? Fondant, that's what they call it. Yeah, and then J Ward's cat man says that they have cats. How many cats do you have? Alright, so I made a smaller square. Looks, oh, looks like a brownie. You know? Yeah, just like a brownie. You want to take a little nibble? <laughs> okay, so <laughs> this is, uh, it's a little bit too big though. Let's try to, hey honey, I know. You want some? I know. Let's try to cut off a little bit more of that. Can you see what's happening? Yeah. So this is, ooh, I'm gonna get a container really quick. We have. Yeah, I'm gonna put, do something with all these bits. 
Should I throw the, the glass in? Yeah, that's fine. I wonder how much do I have. Oh, you know what? I'll use parts of this for for, other for the last attempt. Yeah. Um, all right, so let's just slide this out of our workspace a little bit. Whoop. Okay, um, more comments. Okay. Hollywood One says, how are you? Doing well. It's my birthday. I'm pretty excited. Um, Sarah got me a, a new controller for the Xbox. I'm pretty excited for that because it's one of the fancy ones with back buttons. And I'm really excited for Destiny 2 is coming out, which is a, if you don't know, it's a game that I'm excited for. <laughs> uh, Thorn Wen says, ha, says hello. Hello. And then Nita says, Jason, it's nice to see a cat man that's not scary <laughs> to see at night. Some cat men are scary, lol, but not all. Um, Jay says they have a few outdoor and a few indoor kitty cats. And Holly says, happy birthday. Oh, thank you. So, this is my top... I put on a top thing. I should have made them a little bit smaller than I did, probably. But you only have so much space for whatever to work with. I think it's turning out to be a real masterpiece. I, you know what? I think it's not actually too bad. It's good. You just wait till I have my garnish and my, I don't know, what do you call that? I guess with syrup on there where I can write happy birthday or something. Yeah. Yes, honey. We hear you. We hear you. Can y'all hear from you? Oh. Somebody is more than intrigued about what is going on here. <laughs> the noise is just going. Yeah. Don't worry, you'll get some, you'll get some. So, let's see. Alright, layer two, I want to at least have three layers. Three layers. The wood cake is fun without three layers. Be careful you don't get stuff in your shirt. Oh, yeah, that's true. Alright, so, cake going back down here. Just going to go up here. And we're gonna take one more. Wait, did I do the ocean white fish? Yeah, I thought you did that first. No, I think I opened that one first, but didn't use it. No, I used a poultry something. Oh, you mean use Mariner's Catch? Yeah, this is ocean white fish. We'll try okay. that. Okay. Okay. Well, you're opening that up. Oh, you already got it open. Yeah. Well, I'll that... read some comments while you're done right, with that. Try not to get splattered by this. Okay. Jay cool. says, <laughs> put cow put cat milk from the store on it. Lol. <laughs> Nita says that I need to start cutting some veggies on that cutting board right now. <laughs> um, okay. Sue says, happy birthday, and how, how old are you? Nice cat. How old are you? Oh. Look, see, people like you. You are cute kittens, aren't you? Um, all right, small square next. And what I was going to try to do, I don't know if I have room for it. We'll see. Um, it'll be a surprise in a second. So let's go small square. Jay's asking about the brand of cat food. Um, this is just Friskies, which I don't know if Friskies is good or bad. It's kind of cheapo stuff. Um, Corn cheese on the table. Because I didn't know... Hey, honey. I didn't know <laughs> how much I'd be kind of wasting. Hey, <laughs> quit that. I didn't know how much I'd be kind of wasting. Um, so I don't have any recommendations for cat food brands or types. Honey. Come on. Come on. We got to be patient until the work is done. She is all over this. Yeah, I don't have any recommendations for types or brands or anything. Um, I said if it's good quality or bad quality. But the way I figured it, even if it's bad quality, it's kind of like if you have bad quality, I don't know, chips or something one time, it's not gonna, it's not gonna kill you. That's kind of how I thought about it. Alright, my square, I thought it was gonna be significantly smaller, but I really don't have too much to work with here. So, alright. Yes, honey. So. Oh, they say they can hear her. <laughs> they're very vocal. All right, so. Oh, my. Oh, I need more room. Bring this back. Bring this here. So we're going to take that and put it on top, honey. Can you toss your glass to the side or something? Or oh, yeah. Maybe toss. I'll put it over here. Oh, and now I'm dripping this all over the place. Can you toss this in the sink? Uh, sorry, there's not a, a very big operation to work with. Okay. Um, Holly says that uh, they don't know if you remember, but they're getting a new kitten. When they said they were getting a new kitten, but they got a new kitten Ooh. and named him Freddy Krueger because of his nails. I think that's so what? cute. Does he have long, vicious nails? Freddy. Porn G, what do you, Porn G has her face in the can. Okay. Porn G, stop. Well, 
Andy, you're gonna right. boil your appetite. I'll try this in a second. Alright, so what I have here oh, come on. is my three tier cake. And you can see it's pretty stacked up. Oh, the camera looks a little funny. So I might try to get my knife here, oh. edge up the sides a little bit. And my idea originally was to get uh, a sh oh. was to get a shredded con. There we go, shredded. Oh, to add a little flair. Yeah. So you know how, like, on their stacks of like wedding uh -huh. cakes, they have like icing around like, the edges. Ice around. Yeah. That was kind of my plan. I don't know if it's really gonna. Oh, it's more liquid than I thought. Um, maybe we do individual pieces? Yeah, we'll see. Um, people saying anything while I try? Um, no, they're commenting on Holly's cat name. Yeah? What do yeah. people think? Um, Nita says it's great. Uh, um, yeah, and yeah. Pinchel Looks Sweet says that the cake looks cute. So. Thanks. I'm kind of a pro, so... I, <laughs> oops. My original plan was to... Well, I should use a spoon. Was to kind of garnish the outside with, like, little chunks. Right now, I'm just kind of tossing some pieces along the edge to see what it kind of looks like. Um, hmm. What could be done? Do you think I should still do the blended bag thing to, like, write a happy birthday on there? Would that be it? I mean, we can try to make, like, a mousse or something. We have to turn on the blender, though, which isn't going to be very nice for y'all's well, ears. Well, it'll just be a lot of second, I think. Yeah, we can do that if you want. Do you uh, want me to get... Yeah, you want to get some of the scraps? A blender. Or maybe put a little bit of water in it. Okay. And that way we can write, like, happy birthday on it, I think. This is going to be three cakes. I think right now it's going to be one and a half cakes. Based on how, how much difficulty I'm having. And I might try to make this into, like, a real video where I actually plan it out a little bit more. But I always think it's a fun idea to, like, try things with people and brainstorm with people. So if you have any good cat cake ideas or ideas of how to make things ooh, look nice, you let me know. So do you want me to take all these scraps and blend them, or just like... Um, just them? a, just a little bit of them. I don't think we're gonna need too, too much. Right, just to write happy birthday. Right. So just like a chunk or two. Um, which... Pro tip, you have an older kitty who may not be able to eat as much. Sometimes what I've done before is getting, like, getting... Is to have, a uh, wet food, and then you put a little water in there, just a little bit, and kind of blend it up. And they can eat, or almost lap that up, but kind of like, it's kind of like a liquid diet. They can uh, drink it and still get food calories and stuff. Okay, I'm going to blend this real quick. Still be able to eat it. Alright, so if you have a mute button, um... This would be the time. Yeah, you might want to mute it for about, I don't know, we'll, 10 seconds. We'll wave our arms when it's safe. Yeah, alright, so, three, two, one, blend time. Okay. Oh, the blender over there. Three, two, one, blend time. <laughs> three, yeah, there it is. Alright, we're good. We're good. Sorry about that. Um, oh yeah, that's a good way to get older kitties to eat stuff. Also, if you have cats that you kind of want to get more water into, but they're not necessarily drinking water for whatever ailment or reason, sometimes you can get like a wet food that's already kind of liquidy to begin with, put a little bit of water and blend it up, and then they eat that, and they're kind of drinking more, so... A good way to sneak in some liquid if you want to. Alright, so. I have. I have to wash my hands off because I don't want to get in my face. I put some. some edging with these like strips on here. And right now I'm gonna wipe this thing down and make this. see if we can make this like an Instagram picture? <laughs> you know, like. You know how people take it like, oh, I'm just at lunch and. Snap this picture of this perfect looking thing where it's like, okay, it looks like you staged that thing for 45 minutes. That is what happens because Jason's eaten with me before and watched it. Oh, yeah, that's true. <laughs> Very true. Very true. I don't know if I made this too thin. Uh, when I saw it in there, it looked... I don't know. That'll be alright. Okay. You can go grab a bag. Yeah. Get it filling. So. Oh, actually. Would you mind uh, reading some things since I missed it? People are saying things. Oh, oh I'm not yeah. talking to it. <laughs> sure, sure. Uh, 
sure. All right, let's see what's happening. Um, so Jay said that their cats only like brands like Friskies, Nine Lives, and brands that are not store brands. Oh, okay. um, And Holly says, have you guys ever thought of doing a book about cats or just things that you like in general? Uh, no, not really. Because I like to know about stuff a little bit more before I tell other people what to do. And I'm worried that I give people bad advice. So that's why even on the channel, like people have asked about uh, flea remedies before. And I've read some stuff about things, but I don't want to recommend like, oh, you should put this on your cat and that actually being harmful to your cat. Because a lot of people will put stuff out there of things that work, but it's not like things that are necessarily good. If right. that makes sense. I would say that we're like enthusiasts, but not necessarily we're not like experts. the experts to go to. Because um, Holly says that she knows that like Simon's cat, they did a book. They're wondering if we would do something like that. Nita well, says, um, use some of your catnip, sprinkle it over and decorate. That was a plan and that might actually happen. And uh, Random Sue says you um, that they do short cat videos. Interesting. Oh, cute. Jay... One of Jay's cats is pregnant. Oh. That's exciting. Wow. Um, Sam Coleman says you could puree the cat food and pipe rosettes. Do what? Puree the cat food and pipe rosettes. I don't What's know pipe? if we're... Oh, like the little things yeah. on it? It's not that sturdy. <laughs> we don't have any piping tips, so we're just going to have to go with cutting the corner of the bag, I think. Uh -huh. um, Thorn Nguyen says, I love cats. I'm taking care of 15 abandoned cats in Vietnam. Wow. That's wow. A lot. Good for you. Also in Vietnam. Um, that's cool. Oof, that's and a lot, then though. Emily says hi. Hi, Emily. And then Nita says DIY cat toy hammocks, hammocks, etc. for the book. That could be fun if you come up with a book of like different all DIYs kind of crafts. and stuff. Yeah. Which I've got a couple more good DIY videos, like ideas. Actually, I have one coming out next week if I edit it in time, which I will because I every Friday there's a video out there, <laughs> whether it's live or one I've done. Yeah. But I actually have that one recorded early, like this week. Excuse me. Um, and some people have been giving me really good ideas and comments of videos. Oh, for different things so, to try. Yeah. Cool. Okay, um, so are we ready? Ish. I don't know. You just cut the very tip of it? Is that Yeah, you, you want it to be small. So you have some control. Right. Before I do that, ideally, so... What? Sorry. I was going to say, I wouldn't close it all the way because you want to be able to push the air out. So yeah. You some, Look at that. Pro tip. Have some control. Um... So, I wanted to get like a sprig of something kind of on the top of this. Kind of like decorative, kind of like a can- oops. Kind of like a candle. And we grew catnip out in the garden this year. But, that catnip kind of died. But, catnip is part of the mint family, Sarah. Yes, it is. Um, so what I did do is get a piece of regular mint. Because it'll still kind of go after that. So, yeah, I got a little- Unfortunately, the catnip has reached the end of its life for the season, so. I got a little sprig here. Which I was just gonna take off like a little thing and stick it on the top. I mean, lots of times in fancy restaurants they'll put stuff on the side, but I'm trying to make this almost like a candle. Okay. All right. Uh, oh <laughs> yeah. Look at that. Looking good. Okay. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay. Um, Random Sue says, speaking of catnip, that their cats don't like it, but yesterday they bought a honeysuckle toy and they love that. Really? Honeysuckle? I had no idea. That's really interesting. Um, Jay wants to know one. how long we're, this, this is happening. What, the this cake, cake stuff? Ha this cake adventure. I guess until we finish. <laughs> um, we don't have a set schedule. Not too much longer, because I think, yeah, like I said, I'm just going to do this and show you what you can do with remnants, or if you don't want to be... As adventurous, maybe? Yeah. Um, and then Nita said we could also use the cat grass, because that's in the background. Um, Holly says, have you got any favorite cat YouTube videos? Uh, well, more like channels. Um, I mean, Simon's Cat is always really awesome. I like that. I recently found one called Cat Lessons. Uh, or you just hopped in the drawer. Just hopped in the drawer. Cat Lessons had some really neat DIYs. They'd be like... You know, a box bed, but they like really craftily made it into a like a shark. Look. Oh, that was cool. Um, those are one of the big ones that come to mind. I guess Cold Marmalade. Actually, I don't watch it very, very much, but maybe I should watch more. I think I told somebody before. Like, 
I don't want to watch too many things because then your ideas start to get influenced by them. And I'm trying to be my own man, if you will. Oh, all right, honey, let's get out of the drawer. <laughs> um, Jay wants to send pictures of their cats. Where's a good place to send cat pictures? I, I think Instagram is a good place yeah, if you that want would be best. to even just like post your picture and then like tag Jason, um, tag, tag the Cats and Pats account so then he can see it. That's, that, that's a I good think place. that's a, that might be the only way because I don't think it's a good way to submit things anywhere else. Yeah. I thought about trying to do that with a website, but I didn't either, either know how to do it or something that would cost a lot of money. So I was like, Instagram's free. Yeah, Instagram, <laughs> Instagram works really well. And the account is Cats and Pats, yeah, just cats like the pets. channel. All right, Prunji, you gotta hold off, honey. All right, so like, I just snip the very tip of it. Yeah. Just, How do you prevent it from squirting out everywhere? Uh, just don't have. Yeah, do that. Uh -huh. Okay. Oh, now she's getting into that one. Okay. Let's cut off. We can always cut off more, but I say we start with a little bit. Okay. All right, and then honey? you just don't honey? let me get her. All right, so. Now. Should I try to do cursive? Or make it. Um, do whatever you think is going to work. Uh, so yeah, uh, here. you got to wait. Alright, well let me just show you. So this is where we're currently at. And it's... It's actually turned out fairly well, I think. I'm Plus impressed. The top is nice. Um, you want to take a quick... You take a quick picture with your phone? Okay. Maybe? I was like, where's my phone? And I realized that I'm, uh... Streaming on it right now. Oh my goodness, you. Yeah. Frenchie, you're blocking you my light. No. Oh. Wow. Aggressive. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Somebody, I just saw it popped up for a second that somebody said they love your kale shirt. Oh, hey. thanks. I got hey. it at Target a couple years back. Hey, 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 hey. She is like going after this stuff. All right. One second, honey. We'll get it in a second. We'll get it in a second. Excuse Jay me, wants me. to know how many cats we have. We have three kitties. An orange one, a black one, and a striped one. You'll see their names as well? Sure. So the oh. orange one that... Oh, we're getting grips. We're getting grips. I just don't know how to do this without... You gotta... What? Wrap your hand around the back side of it so okay. you're squeezing, not like... Okay. I just don't know how to do it without knocking over what I already had. I okay. think I've done that first. Um, yeah, so we have three cats. So the orange cat that's right here um, trying to get all the food. That's big orange, but we usually call her Porngy. And then the striped one is named Moxie, but we normally call him Moo Moo. And then the black one is named Luna, but she has a variety of nicknames that she also goes by. <laughs> All of our cats have a handful of names. All right, so I'm just kind of squeeze yeah, it out. Yeah, see, I think I made it a little bit too thin. Porngy, come on, honey. All right, so we're just going to try We're going to do plain text because Curse is definitely not having them. So... Uh, oh, no, no, do I have too much stuck up here? Hey. I'm struggling. Or did I hit like a spot? Oh, oh no, it's coming out. Oh no. This is going to be an interpretation of <laughs> Happy Birthday. Maybe it should just be an yeah, HB. You want to hold it back at the back. You don't want to hold it right at the tip. Say what? Like this. I don't know these things. You want to try to? Oh. But I'm left-handed. I'm doing this with my right hand, so I don't know how well that will go. I think There's the problem is. There's a lot of air in here. Oh, is that what it is? Yeah. All right, maybe just try an HB, and that's what we'll try it with. Let's see. Um. Where? Where are we? Oh, high school toy. So. Uh, oh, the yeah, last right. thing I read was how many cats do we have? Oh, Holly's British. I didn't know that. Yeah, hey, Holly. Um. You check YouTube stuff. Uh, how many cats do we have? All right. So, Han Fan Fan said she loved your kale shirt. Uh, I don't know what we have. Jay says, if you want any cats or kittens, just ask him. <laughs> but he's in New York. Unfortunately, there's always plenty of kitty cats to go around. But I appreciate the offer. <laughs> um, 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 if you could visit any country, what would it be and why? So... There's actually a lot of various countries or continents oh, in the country. I just squirted it everywhere. <laughs> no, that's okay. Um, no, I like to visit. I, Japan is kind of high on my list. Um, no particular reason, I guess. Sarah's struggling over here. This is just a puddle. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, let's just. This is. That's happy birthday, guys. That, that's happy birthday. There's that pile there. 
Um, I think Japan would be really cool. I think there's a lot of oh. Ano gaming nerd culture mm. stuff there. They have like districts and things where arcades and stuff are still really big and hopping. Um, I hear New Zealand's really beautiful and pretty awesome to check out. And I would just like to actually do the whole European tour. I love to see, you know, France and Germany and Britain and Spain, Italy. Spain, yeah. So that would be fun. I lots thought, of countries. Please. I always thought doing like a Mediterranean. Porn she has her head in that thing. Okay. I always thought doing a Mediterranean cruise would be cool because I've seen you know online when people do them. It's kind of neat because you get to hop around from a lot of different cities and a lot of different countries right there on the Mediterranean Sea and see a lot of things in a short time. I mean, it might feel a little rushed, I guess, mm -hmm. but I think it could be cool because you could do that and then maybe if you really liked a place, you could plan another vacation in the future to like spend more time there. I think that'd be fun. Alright, Kelsey says, do you have Facebook? Yep, it's Cats and Pats on Facebook. It probably has like a hundred likes on there because I'm not very No, actually, I am kind of active. No. Okay, a lot of my videos are on there. Check it out. I'd really appreciate it. That's a way to sell it. <laughs> cats and Pats on Facebook. Right. Uh, Nita asked, did the clips affect the cat's behavior? Nope. I don't think they noticed anything different at all. Yeah. But, uh, Pinch of Luck says she's on the way to help. That would be... That'd be awesome. I think one problem was it was too thin. I put in too much water. Yeah, it's okay. I still love it. It's you. my fault. I ruined it. It was just also cute. I have a cat named called Ollie. Oh, that's cute. Ollie's so sweet. And a little kin, but it uh, oh, doesn't have a name yet. Well, that's fun. We, Luna didn't have a name for a good few months. For a while, she was just Baby Kitten. Yeah, <laughs> Baby Kitten. And that's why she probably has so many nicknames, too. Yeah. Um, Tom says, happy birthday. Thanks, Tom. Tom, escape. That's uh, Nita says, Sarah, you're left-handed, love lefties. Yep, Sarah, yeah, the lefty. Me. Uh, Janice says, pinch of luck, get a paintbrush and paint it on. Uh, I don't know if you have any paintbrush. No, I've never been to Puerto Rico. I have a friend from Puerto Rico, um, and he's offered, but, well, has he offered before? I thought about going down there with him, but no, I've never visited. That's the thing, is if you have a friend who lives yeah. somewhere else, whether it's even, like, a different city or anything, like... That they can show you around and give you like the inside scoop. I think that's probably the best way to travel. <laughs> Tom says, "I love my little, I love your little beard." <laughs> yeah, it's just like a not shaving. Like this stuff bothers me enough that I'll shave it. Like you know, day of. This just kind of goes till it gets a little annoying and gets shaved off. <laughs> um, uh, name, happy birthday, meow language. Hi says, oh, well, Jay Edwards, do you have tabbies? Um. What, what constitutes a what constitutes a tabby? I'm not really. I guess I always think of all cats being like a tabby cat, but I guess that's not right. So I don't know. We got a, an orange one, a black one, and a striped one. <laughs> <laughs> um, Nina says, "Porgy sounds like her porn name." Yep, that is a that's come that, up before. <laughs> yeah. it, that happened because you know her name was Big Orange, and then we just got, so started calling her Orangey, and then it turned into Orangey Porgy Pudding Pie, and then that just got shortened to Porgy. So, that's that's an insight into the way our minds work. <laughs> so, like Nita mentioned, we're just going to get a little... Oh, a little catnip. This is catnip. dried catnip, not fresh, in case you were wondering. I'm just going to sprinkle it around like it's... Look artsy. at that. And... Voila. Ta-da! <laughs> sure. <laughs> um, so, my other idea for... Another cake, which I'll just, uh, should I show over here? My other idea for a cake was to make like a mud cake. So, with your scrap leftovers, you can you know, toss them in a little bowl, maybe you got some liquidy stuff you can kind of, kind of <laughs> squirt in there, and then get like a bag of treats, and get the treats and kind of <laughs> dunk them in there. So what's going to gonna be, because don't, doesn't mud cake usually have some sort of worm? What's going to be the worm? Or are we just skipping? Well, that? I mean, the treats are kind of the wormy things. Okay. They're kind of like rocks. It's like a non wormy okay. rock cake. Okay. It's kind okay. of an idea. Okay. Okay. Um, so I was going to let the kitties kind of have at this. I guess I can bring them up here on the table. I'm yeah, because sure. otherwise no one's going to be able to see them. Yeah, unless I move the camera. So let's try to clear it a little bit and then we can yeah, try to. Yeah, I'll clear out a little space. Do you want to look here? at comments and all? Yeah. Tidy. Emily Ray says we just call them kitty. Yep. And that, works. that might be their name forever. So, keep that in mind. <laughs> we had, uh, oh, there's a cat at my parents' house. His name is Fuzzy Head. Because when I got him, he had a cute little fuzzy head. And so that's why I just called him, because nobody had named him yet. And now Fuzzy Head is just his name. 
but I like it, and I think it sounds cute. So, you do you. Um, 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 um. Tabby's having an M on their forehead, don't they? Uh, says Random Sue. Is that right? I don't know. I know Maine Coons have an M, but they also have a certain, like, body type. Yeah, they have an extra flu. Yeah. But Moo Moo, uh, Moxie, the stripy one, has an M on his head, so maybe he's a tabby cat. But I don't know, Random Sue, but I like that idea. Uh, Jira said they have white paws. Is that... There's gotta be more of a caveat than just that. But do all of them have white paws? Once again, Mimu has white paws, right? I think. Yeah, he has little socks on. Okay. Which is so cute. Holly says, funny enough, I have a best friend from America. We met over Snapchat. And the only reason we basically became friends is because we liked 21 Pilots. So we started talking. That's pretty cool. That is neat. How, how did you actually meet the first time like, to start talking about it? Because I'm... I assume it's a lot of Yeah, finding on. people on Snapchat, I feel like, that's hard. And do you have a favorite 21 Pilots song? I only actually have, or know, a few. Um, so I'd be interested. I'd be interested for any, like, songs you think are awesome that are maybe under the radar. Um, Kelsey says she'll send a pic on Facebook. Tom says that they made all the cat toys that you made in the cat toy DIY video. Awesome. Sometimes it's, I don't know, cats are so funny, like, they will love a toy for a little while. And then just, boom, be done with it. Same thing with the beds and stuff. You make like a fun bed or you have it out there and they're all in it for like weeks and weeks. And then they're gone. Um, Nina says the kick looks good. And he says, Tad references to the stripes. It's not a breed, but a coloration. Hmm. Hmm. And he says, yes, white on her chin, like a bib. Oh, okay. Okay, so let's... Let's get, gather. Yeah, let's Gather see. the kittens. Who wants to... <clears throat> I wonder if I leave it up there. Okay. Right it's right there. Maybe we'll have it. Where's Pointy? Whoop! Did you find Pointy? No, I can find Lou. Let me. We gotta find her first. Pointy! She's been out of the whole time. Oh, this is Mimu. Mimu probably doesn't like to be held like this, but that's gonna happen. Mimu. Mimu is a shoulder kitty for sure. Okay, bud. Did you find her? It sounds like she's struggling back there. Just tell her that you're giving her wet food and she'll be excited. She was looking at a bird in the window. Jay says that I'm holding a tabby. Oh, okay. Come on, Moxie. Okay. Hey, and tabby. now Blue's in the back, but I can go grab her. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and toss these up there. Alright, guys. What do you think of this? <laughs> There's like, ah, whatever. <laughs> Happy see. birthday, kittens. Happy almost birthday. I wonder what the Would you like the wet food more? Or the knit more? Try to slide it back so you can see. Uh oh. Now we're a little more interested. But if you, if you face the other way, people can face. see your cute little face. <laughs> what the? Nice. Uh, Let's move this way. Slide this back a little bit. Whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> there you go. They're like, what is happening? Yeah, they're like, why are you on the table? Why are you going up this? But he's like, no, I only want this side. <laughs> All right, so she's licking the side part, not the actual cake itself. Yeah, the puree stuff. The happy birthday part. <laughs> I wonder if I can lip, up, lip this up without, like, dropping everything everywhere. Let's... Whoop, whoop, whoop. There we go. That, yeah, that's enough of my hand. Emily says that they bought their cats. I'm seeing your... Oh, yeah, that was... Okay. Sorry, that was me, uh... <laughs> I was trying to get the camera out so you can Emily see. Emily said that we they bought their cats all expensive toys and they just played in the bag. Yeah. <laughs> that sounds about right. Yep. That or the um, box, depending on what you get. Nita says sing happy birthday to them. <laughs> happy birthday, dear kittens. That's um, all I got. And then Holly says that oh, as far as meeting on Snapchat, they met um sort of met like how did you get my Snapchat? Because we're in a group on Facebook, and at first uh. I thought, um, oh, okay. So it was kind of like a weird thing that happened, but then I guess they became friends. Oh, okay. Interesting. And then Ham Fam says, this is off subject, but their kitties' names are Nigiri, Maki, Echo, Kabuki, Ash, Flittermouse. It's pronounced Flittermouse. Uh, okay. um, that means bat in German, which is what he looks like. A bat. Oh, that's cute. It's very cute. Yeah. Creative with the names, y'all. Wait, but what about the other names that... What is it? 
Nigiri. Where? Ma- Nigiri. Akira, Echo. So where did those come from? Were those just ones that you liked? Kabuki. Flutter. Yeah. Very nice. Maki Echo. Very creative. Huh. Yeah, can you, are there any more translations we should know? <laughs> Tom says that their cat's name is Bolin, and Pinch of Luck says happy birthday. How do you spell that? B-O-L-I-N. Oh, Ham Pam is that, says, is that like Bolin from Avatar? Oh. See, I haven't watched Avatar. Neither. Or Which not. I assume they mean Avatar The Last Airbender. Yes, yes. yes. That's what they said. I oh, just is that right? it. Oh, okay. I didn't know. Sorry. <laughs> Alright, so the one that wants the cake is Big Orange, which is no surprise because she, she loves what? She was there. Oh, she just pulled a chunk off the plate onto the table. <laughs> I'm surprised Moo Moo isn't all over this because he's normally, you know, a wet food fiend. Hey, Moo. Hey, Moo, you can be in camera if you want. Mr. Moo. All right, I'm going to try to slide you in camera, Moo. So you can either try some or you can say bye to the peoples. Oh, oh, oh. Moo Moo's very suspicious. <laughs> what if this can be pets? Does that sound good? Hmm. Kelsey says happy birthday. Holly says... Thank you everybody for the birthday wishes. Yeah, Holly says that they have a ginger cat named Toby Lee. I wanted to call it Toby Turner, like a YouTuber. I don't know Toby Turner, unfortunately. I I just know very little bit. But you know them, yeah. I've There's heard. a lot of YouTubers I don't really know. That's the interesting thing about YouTube. All the time I find channels that have millions of subscribers, and I'm like, I've Does never know heard of or yeah. seen this person in my life. Which is kind of cool, I think. I think it's pretty neat. Yeah. Um, Nita says, Moo Moo is camera shy. He doesn't want to be judged. Yeah, right. <laughs> he doesn't want to eat in public. <laughs> Poor Moo. But believe you. Believe you me. Believe me. Believe you me. When I have two, like, wet foods down, um, because Linda doesn't like wet food, because... That's the kind of girl she is. Yeah. Um, like, Big Orange will eat most of hers, and Moo will eat his, and then Big Orange walks off, and Moo kind of comes over and finishes the rest of it. <laughs> he, uh, he really enjoys it. I like how she's, like, licking off the edges. Yeah, oh. and then she'll, like, take off a little bite. Yeah, she goes and gets a chunk and brings it, brings it back with her. Like a little jungle cat. Um, so, cake was mostly a su- success, I think. I think so. I think I could, I don't know, I could do a little bit more work. My other idea was to kind of like a, well, like a braided light cake, which I hope to have some braided? more... Braided? What does that even mean? Striped, I don't know. Oh, okay. Striped. So <laughs> let me just explain it. Okay. The idea was to have multiple colored uh, cat foods, and I was going to cut like yeah, straight up stripes in them, and then kind of put them all together in a line, and then Ooh. use like a piece of uh, maybe like spaghetti, Ooh. like a dried spaghetti thing, to kind of stick it through and hold oh. them together so it looks like a striped thing. Or... Do all these little square pieces and put it together in like a checkerboard. Uh oh, she's about to knock it over. Oh. Top tears about it. Nina off. says that she's surprised that um, that Luna doesn't like wet food because most cats prefer it. Yeah. You can see that it's kind of going to fall over silly. Yeah. She's like, uh, excuse me. <laughs> that is mine. I was working on that. <laughs> Holly um, says, sorry, I know so many questions, but I'm just curious. Would you get a tattoo? Um, what would it be and why? I always like questions. Um, I think they're fun, especially, I mean, it's fun on live streams. You can do questions. Uh, yes, I would, potentially. But I think it would be hard for me to figure out something I really want. Um, I really like those people, like, they'll get, like, a whole sleeve done with, like, various things that kind of artsy looking. But I doubt I'd do that, because, once again, I don't think I'll like anything that much. Um, probably would never get a cat tattoo, much as I love kitty cats. Um... I really like anything casino looking, like dice or maybe even Alice in Wonderland. Or like, oh. oh it toppled. There it is. Or uh, like, you know, the spades, hearts, clubs, diamonds, like something with that would be kind of cool. But once again, I think, I don't know, that might be ridiculous to have a tattoo of. Yeah, I'm kind of the same way. Like, if there was something that I really wanted, I would get it. I'm not like, no, I'll never have one. But I also just, like, the idea doesn't appeal to me, and there's nothing that I can really think of that I'd want. You would not get the spades, hearts, diamonds? I don't think so. Bunch of dice or something? Sometimes I think, like, sometimes family stuff, like, that kind of makes sense. Because, like, those people will always be your family. But even that, there just isn't anything that really appeals to me that I... Oh, yeah, I want to get a tattoo of that. Right. I don't know. Just not my thing, I guess. Yeah. Yeah. To each their own. Um, 
We Holly. have to be running soon because oh. I'm gonna get some birthday dinner lunch stuff. So yeah, I'm just putting that out there. Okay. I'm not saying like we're cutting off right now. <laughs> but just okay, well, Courtney keeps eating. All right. um, we can do a couple more comments. Um, people are talking about Avatar: Last Airbender. Ooh. So that's fun. Um, it is the named after the character from the. Sh from the oh, show. okay. So, um, Holly said Leaning Tower of Cat Food. Yes. Emily said, ha ha, I'm not sure to what though, so, something you said was funny, or something that happened was funny. Um, and Tom says, thanks, um, oh, talking about the cat. It's also one of their faves, it'd be funny if they had another cat named Mako. So that's Is that cool. also someone from Air Bender? I guess so. See, I guess they're just behind on, on our Avatar. I like that y'all are, are chatting up with each other, though. That's it's fun. fun. I know. It's like a community, a community. of cat people. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that brings everybody together, like, I don't know. I think if you like... I thought a car was crashing. It's not. <laughs> you have people that like cats, you know. Like, anytime I learn somebody like likes cats or loves cats, that automatically gives me, like, a plus one about... Yeah, I mean, it's like, like another connection. Right. I just, like, think, well, you know, they can't be all bad. <laughs> they love some kitty cats. Um, with that said, I think, well, our cake got half eaten. I'm sure that Mimi will have a field day with some of it in a little bit. He's always down there right now. Mimi! Mimi, do you want to try this out some? <laughs> I set it down, he's like... <laughs> that looks good. Um, yeah. Thanks everybody for coming out. Thank you for the birthday wishes. Mm -hmm. I think we might get some birthday sushi, which would be kind of fun. Ooh. One of our restaurants, like, I'm on their mailing list, like, emailed out, like, Oh, it's your birthday. Here's a $10 coupon. I'm like, I'm down with that. <laughs> you might get a customer today. <laughs> um, so, any last things before we get... Um, Pinch of Luck says, have a great birthday. People are asking what time it is. It's 9 in the UK. Here, it is around 4. 4, yeah. On the East Coast of the US. Eastern Standard. And Random Sue says, have a nice birthday. Bye. Or, have a nice birthday dinner. Sam Coleman says, happy birthday. Um, so, yeah. Alright, well, everybody, thank you again. Thank you. I hope you have happy birthdays whenever your birthdays are. Mm -hmm. And if you do make a cat cake of some sort, or have more cat cake ideas... Please tag me in it, send it to me, or even just describe it verbally. All the pictures would probably be, probably be best. So, let me know, and I'm going to try to figure out if I can reach across this table to finish this okay. thing. Ham Fam says happy oh. birthday, and Stacy says happy birthday. Thank you! Bye!